Today I'm updating the Asus ROG laptop from Windows 10 to Windows 11. So I'm going to search for update, go to check for updates. It says this PC meets the minimum requirements for Windows 11. So let's download and install. Before downloading Windows 11, we must update to the latest version of Windows 10. So it's going to first download the latest version of Windows 10, and then we'll perform that update. There we go, now it's installing. Looks like we'll need to restart, so I'm going to click restart. Computer's restarting. It's getting Windows ready. The computer restarted, got the latest version of Windows 10. And now we have the option to download and install Windows 11. So I'm going to click download and install. Accept the waiver and install. We're 100% downloaded, now the install is starting. I have the laptop in performance mode. The CPU is running at 4 GHz as it's installing Windows 11. This is what the fan sounds like when it's running in turbo mode. I'm now at 82% on the installation. Windows 11 is 100% installed. It says upgrade to Windows 11. Status pending restart. So let's restart it. Okay, let's restart the computer. Laptop screen is saying updates are underway. It says updates are at 100%. That went rather quickly. Now it says working on updates again. We're at 30%. It's restarting. And now it says it's working on the update. Right, now it's at 44%. All right, it looks like it started. Okay, I'm signing in. All right, there it is, Windows 11. Laptop's now upgraded. There's the new start menu. Okay, beyond the new start menu, when we open up, we get an advertisement. What looks like to be a free trial of Game Pass. Here's a look at the new start menu again. We can view all our apps here. So it's more of a move than anything else. Let's open up Armory Crate. Armory Crate looks the same, except you can see the windows edges are curved. Snapping is the same, except you have curved windows edges. Put that in Windows mode. So we have the start menu, which is the same, the search bar, which is the same. We have a button for our desktops. So you can make virtual desktops, different virtual desktops, and close that one. Got something called widgets here. So it looks like we have some widgets. We have the weather, stock market, sports, news. There's chat. It's a little wonky looking right now for some reason. Microsoft Edge looks the same. If we take a look at folders, we can see all the icons are updated. Looks a little nicer. It took from 12.35 to 1.16 to download and install Windows 11. So around 40 minutes total. So that's about it. Very similar feel with a slightly sleeker look. Start menu move to the center. This Asus ROG laptop is now updated to Windows 11. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and a comment below. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.